So it's 1861 and civil war is tearing apart the nation. So obviously the new America needs someone who can handle it. But instead they have Jefferson Davis, the only president of the Confederate States of America. Kinda looked like a creepy old man. Born in Kentucky only a hundred miles away from Lincoln. Jeffy was a former US senator, Mexican war hero, and generally good old boy. Davy was against secession until it happened. And then they're like, hey, let's make this guy president, why not? So why did he accept? Well, he was kind of a racist. Which doesn't really make sense, but still a lot of people think it. Kind Kinda sucked to be the president of the CSA though. Like one time there was a riot of starving citizens so he threw money at them to try and get them to calm down. But that didn't work so he threatened to shoot them. That worked. Anyway, bing bang boom, South lost the war. Jefferson was imprisoned without trial for treason for two years. While there he sold off his estate to a former slave, but then he got out on bail and generally lived a pretty good life. Finally, over a hundred years after the war ended, Jimmy Carter declared Jefferson Davis a legal citizen, except he was dead so it didn't really matter. Also he was blind in one eye. I don't know which. Throat kick!